Many areas throughout the low country are still trying to pick up the pieces after Hurricane Dorian passed through earlier this week. In downtown Charleston, areas still have debris blocking roadways and powerless traffic lights. As of today, only four intersections are still without power. Now, city trash crews began collecting garbage and storm debris today. 138 down trees have been cleared so far citywide. City street sweepers are also out and about sweeping streets downtown in West Ashley and on James Island. Many areas flooded during Hurricane Dorian and the city used pumps to flush out that water. Charleston City Councilman Mike Seeking says although the city prepared well for Hurricane Dorian, he believes more work needs to be done. We're on the process of, in the process of cleaning up. Residents were ready. The residents who knew they flooded in the past left. But what's that lesson? We haven't done enough. If they flooded in the, flooded in the past and they're still flooding, we got to get after that. And that's the real, I think, post lesson. This came through, more coming. So we got to really think about what we're going to do to protect the city from future events. The city's stormwater department says they are continuing their damage assessment process today and will continue working to identify storm related damage in the coming weeks. To find out more about how to report damage or debris trash collection information, visit our website, countonto.com.